she gets to live with Queen Elizabeth II and wear the Queen's shoes? She got the monarch's blessing to publish inside stories about royal life. Who's moving into Windsor Castle with the Queen? Find out here, plus even more juicy details. Queen Elizabeth II has reportedly been shaking things up a bit at Windsor Castle. First, the Queen shocked the world by expressing her wishes that Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, be named Queen Consort when Prince Charles becomes King. Next, she enlisted Prince Charles to give the Queen's speech at Parliament in early May 2022, which reportedly marks only the third time the Queen has missed this event in 70 years. Now it appears as if the long-serving monarch may be taking in a new roommate. The rumors of this new roommate involve a close friend and employee of the Queen. This particular friend currently serves in the official role of personal advisor to Her Majesty, a position that was created specially for her in 2011, per Harper's Bazaar. Importantly, the assistant has long accompanied the Queen on her travels, as well as assisting with her fashion and outfits for over 20 years. In addition, they have also made a number of custom dresses for the Queen, such as the pale yellow dress worn to Prince William and Kate Middleton's wedding. This close friend, confidant, and now roommate is none other than the Queen's so-called best friend, Angela Kelly. Amid continuing reports that Queen Elizabeth is struggling with mobility, The Sun reports that Angela Kelly has now moved into a suite next to the Queen's private quarters at Windsor Castle. An unnamed source told The Sun, she lives there now, she has moved in. It's also worth noting that this living situation is not necessarily a trial run, as Kelly was part of the monarch's COVID-19 bubble, too. Kelly detailed her story of being part of the Queen's inner circle during the pandemic in a revised copy of her book, The Other Side of the Coin, The Queen, The Dresser, and The Wardrobe, which was originally published in 2019. The publication provides an insider's look at daily life with the Queen and is a follow-up to Kelly's first book, 2012's Dressing the Queen, The Jubilee Wardrobe. She's responsible for fashioning the image of this extraordinarily iconic woman. Remarkably, the author and fashion designer received the rare approval and blessing of the monarch to publish both of her books about working with the royal family. In her updated version of The Other Side of the Coin, Kelly provides insights into royal life in the pandemic, detailing the Queen's continued reliance on Kelly throughout times of personal loss and declining health. The author also shares humorous anecdotes from the palace, such as the fact that Kelly wears the Queen's shoes to break them in first, since they share the same shoe size. In a book excerpt, Kelly shares of the job, the work is varied and never stops, and long may it continue. Kelly now counts herself as one of the Queen's closest confidants, but this wasn't always the case. Instead, she spent many years working her way up to this prestigious position. As reported by The Express, Angela Kelly is the servant who became the Queen's soulmate. Kelly has humble roots as the daughter of a nurse and a crane driver. She was born in low-income housing somewhere between the suburbs and inner city of Liverpool. The dresser and dressmaker is described as having a heavy accent and a background quite untraditional among the Windsors, as she's twice divorced and Catholic. Kelly began her royal career as a housekeeper to the British ambassador to Germany, Sir Christopher Malaby, which is where she reportedly first met the Queen in 1992. Kelly apparently moved back to the United Kingdom from Germany soon after meeting the Queen. The dressmaker's ex-husband, Jim Kelly, recounted his ex's 1994 interview with the palace, telling the Daily Mail, She was over the moon about getting the job. It was what she had wanted to do all her life. She didn't care about the salary. Money never bothered Angela. It was about her position. Little did I know how much it would change our life. In 2007, Kelly opened up about her prestigious job, telling The Telegraph, I love the Queen and everything about her. She has allowed me to become closer to her over the years. I would never overstep the mark and I remain in awe of the Queen. Kelly has continued to rise in the Queen's esteem over the decades and gained the coveted title of Lieutenant of the Royal Victorian Order in 2012. And now, it would seem, the dresser has become the monarch's flatmate as well. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about the royal family are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.